This is how Korea. The <laughs> yeah, Ajumas not allowed to enter. <laughs> Only cultivated, elegant women allowed. Yeah, yeah. I thought that was hilarious. Bro. Yeah. So recently, uh, in the Korean news, there was an article that went around saying that uh, there was a gym owner that said um, Ajumas are not allowed at the gym. So Ajumas is like an older Korean woman, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. And uh, he's banned them from going to the gym, or yeah. he or she banned them from going to the gym. Only, what did you say? Elegant. What? Only elegant and cultivated and elegant, uh, elegant women allowed. Yeah. So basically, only hot women allowed in the gym. So I want to read, this is from Korean Herald, and it says, How to distinguish ajumas from women. If one likes free things, regardless of one's age, she's an ajumma. <laughs> If one gets sworn at everywhere but does not know the reason why she's an ajma. If one sits in a seat reserved for pregnant women on the public transport. <laughs> if one goes to a cafe with two people and orders just one cup of coffee and asks for a cup to share. Yes. If one secretly throws food waste into a public bathroom or other toilet. If one is frugal with their own money but not with that of others. There's two more. If one has poor memory and judgment and says the same things over and over again. We have a word for that. We call them konde in Korean. Konde. Yeah, konde. Konde means somebody who's... Uh, it's a little different. I'll get into konde after this. And if one falls and nobody helps her but the God... <laughs> she's an um, And I think... So going back to konde is um, a person who's very old. Not necessarily age-wise, but mentality. In the sense that they'll say, Oh, back in my time. Yeah, like, yeah. that's a konde. Hmm. Right? And it's like Korean people are just so sick of hearing that. Like, yeah, yeah. Oh, I I don't care how it was in your time. Like it's it's not how it is yeah, now. Twenty twenty four. Yeah. Get yeah. through the program. Yeah. yeah. And um, these ajumas, and I think it's interesting to to ban these ajumas because it, it's just interesting. It's I get interesting. it. Like this gym might do really fucking well. Yeah. With like young people. Like, of you course, know, bro. Yeah. If um, you have two gyms in your area, one bans ajumas and one doesn't. It's like I'll go to the one that bans ajumas. But what if like you're uh you're like a woman and you're in like your late 30s because technically if you have a kid you're kind of an ajma right? okay but they don't know that if you're still looking fresh that's what it is it's the way you look and the way you act and the way in the, the way you dress so yeah right? of course so technically speaking ajma is anybody who is an older woman mm. even with the, like with or without a child if you have a child you become an ajma right away yeah right but if you don't have a child if you become older hit a certain age and you become an ajma yeah so it's how you present yourself and yeah. how you um you know how you act with others especially with that list yeah and um dude there are a lot of old korean women um that are in their 40s oh, yeah. that i wouldn't consider ajumas no not at all yeah not at all 